What's going on, everybody? What's up? We are at Vane Mountain, North Carolina, at the LDMA Gold Camp, and we're missing somebody. Can y'all guess who it is? <laughs> Just take a guess. It's that empty chair right there. Old Jacob late. Again. Now, let's see, he was five hours late to the first event we did. He's working on five hours now. Yeah. Well, technically, he was supposed to be here yesterday. Yeah, he was supposed to be here yesterday morning, and then he called me and said, hey, I got stuff I got to get done around the house. I said, yeah, just, you know, come the day of, right? I'll see you at 9 a.m. Or I told myself, I'll see you at 8 a.m. Well, uh, it's 12. <laughs> <laughs> nah, we are, we're out here having a good time, and uh, we're going to let y'all enjoy the adventure with us today. Uh, got a lot of stuff. We've already done some stuff this morning. Did some training. Uh, we've only got 12 participants this time, which I'm fine with that. No big deal. But uh, 12 participants, we did some training with them this morning, let them learn how to learn their machines. And uh, we're going to kind of show you around camp in just a minute and uh, let you see how we got everything set up. I think it looks pretty good myself. Pretty near good. Pretty near good. I, I tell you what, we'll uh, bring you in in just a minute, and I'll show you around, and we'll do that beginner's hunt. All right, everybody's out here doing that first hunt beginner hunt everything's on the surface it's all about just letting everybody find targets you know beep beep no dig pick up right there's a variety of machines out here we got a legend over here we got a garrett ace 250 we got a spectra white spectra we got a simplex we got some another garrett over there looks like a garrett at pro Got a Fisher AT Max over there. Got a Mine Lab Equinox. Got a Garrett uh, Gold Master 24K, I believe that's what it's called. Got a Eureka Mine Lab, and we got another Mine Lab over there. So there's a variety of detectors out here. Everybody's digging and finding some stuff. Well, we uh, are walking up here now to the bath house. Oh, yeah, you know, to the bath house. We gonna uh, let them do a little digging this time. We y'all see who finally showed up? Yeah, see back, see behind me there. I know it's kind of hard to see, but he's actually there. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> now uh, we're going up here to the. Uh, we seeded some stuff up here. What is about three weeks ago? Yeah. Three or four weeks ago, we seeded some stuff up here. Y'all seen that video, I'm sure. And we just put some silver in there. Right? Oh yeah, we put some silver in the ground, and we're uh, we're gonna have a little giveaway at the end of. The, we're giving away a metal detector for this one anyway. Yep. So, uh, before I get too far out of breath and y'all see how out of shape I am, I'm going to log off here. <laughs> but anyway, where are we going? This way. All right, you start a wave. Good job, guys. Good job. <laughs> silver. Any silver you find? Yours. Yeah, you get uh, there should be some uh, wheat pennies in here. We put a bunch of wheat pennies in here. Line in the cage, ready. Go. My man right here found him a silver quarter about where his detector is a minute ago. Have you been successful so far? Oh, I found a lot of pennies. A lot of pennies? Yep. All right, then. Found a token. Did you get it? You got the token. Yep, yeah. that's right. That's So you have been very successful. Is it out? And I don't know if that's just... That's out. Whatever it is, is out. There it is right there. Yep. All right. Thank you. Yep. Now, always double check your hole, though. Make sure ain't nothing else in it. Yeah, somebody said there's more than one penny somewhere. Yep, that has happened. Thank you. You more than one time. Yes, sir. <laughs> yep, there's one right there. All right, good deal. <laughs> I'm here. He made it. He made it. They don't want me to even go to the bathroom. They're afraid I'm going to take off for like five hours. <laughs> All five of the tokens have been found. They are now in my hand. You're going to be taken. And there's one more dime. There's a silver dime in here. It's kind of over that way a little bit. But we're going to give them like five more minutes to hunt. And uh, we'll end this one and give away some stuff. How's that go, Chris? Put that on the YouTube channel. It's going on it. It's going to be another subscriber. Right there. At least two. I'll look and see what people have found. We got we got chewed up pennies. Yeah. 
Oh, and I got a week. All right, and you found a, and you found this horseshoe. I got a dog chain. <laughs> That's pretty cool right there. An old chain link right there. That's old. That's hand forged. So every once in a while I start looking for pennies. I get worried when I start cutting through that when I'm in somebody's yard. I'm like, oh, they went to their internet. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. Or the sprinkler system. Yep. There's yeah, another chain that. piece there. Dog chain. Did you do okay? Anybody else find any interesting relics? Did all right. Oh, God, man. That's fine. I didn't get the sound that sounded like it was. I see a can oh, over here. That's right. That's a relic. That's beautiful. I see that silver quarter over here. So nobody found the silver dime, I imagine. I'm not seeing, like I'm not seeing a bright silver coin. Go he's stick your hand in the wet bucket. Stick your hand in the wet bucket. Where are they at? Number three. You got the knot the digger tool. Congratulations. Thank you. Everybody wants to see. Then find me the knot. Trace. You got a token. All right, so. The person who dug the number three, Kevin, was Kevin. You're next. Nope. I dug number two. You dug number two. You number pick three. He dug number three, so he's going to draw number two. <laughs> number two. <laughs> two or five. <laughs> All right. And he gets the Booker leather sheath. Those things are awesome. All right. Another. Uh, see who drew number. Four. Four was Brad. They're hiding in there somewhere. Stuck on the bottom. B. B. <laughs> Must be an eight. For eight. <laughs> and that'll be a Kellyco hat. Oh, I can't believe the detector has went this long. Ah, the suspense is killing me. <laughs> it's killing me too. <laughs> Alright, so the person that uh, dug out number six was Julie. I'm right, right there. Oh, Lord. She get it? You got the fines pouch. No way, she got it again. God. No way. Are you kidding me? <laughs> that is awesome. Well, I told them guys if you want again, I quit. So <laughs> he did. Too. I want to show you this real quick. So we got uh, appreciate Nocta for sending this tent to us and letting us set this thing up. Uh, it's a mess right now because we've just been doing games and stuff. People have been finding some things as y'all saw and. Uh, yeah, I love the, the, the design and uh, it's a cool background. They got a bunch of different backgrounds they use for their tents. But, uh, you know, just displaying some stuff. Some people are interested now in the uh, pulse dive. I like that. And then I got all these Nocta machines right here. And I uh, got that cruiser, the Simplex, the Legend, and the Gold Finder right here. And I got the little mid midi horde right there for my son. It's his detector. He'll be here later this evening. Help us out with the night hunt. Got this banner here for the Legend and got a Southern Relics banner. Got this Simplex Plus. Uh, I know they don't they don't uh, make this one anymore, but it's still a still a good little banner. And I actually figured out a good way to keep that thing from uh, falling over. I got a well, if the wind picks up, I'm sure it still could, but it looks pretty good. We got this other legend here. This is Chris's, and uh, over here we got a the the uh, note to or this is the Kelly Coat tent. Let me back up and let you see the Kelly Coat tent. And you got that Kelly Coat right there. Appreciate them for letting me have this tent and use it at these events that we do and got a couple things i have for sale here my inventory is low now but uh we're gonna do some games tonight where well, they'll be finding these things right here and i uh, got quite a few of them i appreciate kelly Co for sending those out but yeah here's the uh training area and uh we have the pennant flag set up and the note to flags and i think it looks pretty good i appreciate uh kelvin and he uh was here the day before the event to help me get all this cleaned up. And we're letting everybody test their detectors and uh, got this depth test right here to check out two inch. Of course, it kind of come out of the ground. Now it's on the surface, but we had the two inch and we got one at eight inches. And uh, it might not be two inches, it's close. Got one at eight inches there. And uh, yeah, we we, uh, we have a neat little setup here. A penny flat, penny on edge. Got a silver a coin, 
I think it's a silver half dollar underneath the bed of iron there. It just got all kinds of stuff here. And uh, this one's my favorite, the skeleton key and the brass key. Uh, I've got the skeleton key over here, and it's, it's iron. So, but yeah, over there is the gold section. We were testing everybody's detector with uh, on gold. All right, you ready? Start a wave. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> got five shell casings. I don't remember what number that was a while ago whenever I found that. Well, they're going to be all different because I got different sizes. We put different sizes in, so it's going to be all over the charts. Challenge at it. <laughs> Well, got one. I right, got one nickel. Looking for one more nickel. Got that nickel. Got that nickel. Two nickels. Y'all move on to the next one. Team blue. Team two. Team blue is still over here on the first section. And we've got. He's already got him a target here. Looking for that quarter. Looking for the quarter. Right, next team made its way their way over to the second section. All right, so they look, they found their two nickels. They're up to the last point here to find that quarter. There it is, there it is, there it is. You got what? What you got? Quarter? Got a quarter. There's two of them. Team Red. No. Just one, one quarter. Team Red got it. There's only one quarter in there. All right, so that was the first game, the first stage of the whole game. And I like that. Y'all tell me what you thought about that rendition of that new, that new uh, little game we did there. That was pretty fun. Yeah. Chris said it was a little tweaking we could do to it to make it better. I agree. Only one key in here that they find will unlock that box that Chris has. Get your key, and I'll come back if it's if it fits it. If it fits it, I'll uh, we'll holler at you. Nope. Nope. Everybody's looking for that key. Everybody's looking for that key. Got a key? That don't fit. Don't you know by looking at it. Got a key? I got a big key. You think it is? What do you think about it? Key went in. We're done. Did the key go in? Yeah, in. but what does it turn? Okay. You know, I went over that thing, I Unlocked. think, twice, but the... Okay. <laughs> Goodies for everybody, not everybody. Winning team, winning team. All right, if you were part of the winning team, y'all step right up. <laughs> All right, so these are courtesy of Note to Detectors. Thank you. Your good old fines pouch with a belt attached. Sure. Ooh, those are nice. It's yes, nice, because I don't nice. have a pouch. Yeah. Good uh, job, guys. I keep tearing good job, guys. All right. Good job. Good job, good job, good job. everybody. Yeah. And last but not least, I'm going to award this right here. This is the Note to Premium Shovel. It's adjustable, and uh, it's pretty good when Chris, we and Chris use them. I think his is over there. It's adjustable. You can adjust the size. A real short one for Jacob. A real <laughs> tall one for Chris. <laughs> and this is what the key opened. The knock the shovel. That's shovel. right. There's, that, he opened it up. Inside of it, it said knock the shovel. So I got two shovels so far. And today. now it is yours. Good job. Oh, congratulations, Kelvin. That's Good. my. That's one of my favorite shovels. All right, everybody. So we just uh, took us a little lunch break. Uh, we we love doing that little dysfunctional detecting competition, and um, it's a lot of fun. And we had a winner, and it was somebody different that won it last time, and that's what we like. And we like for other. We like you know a variety of people to win. We're eating lunch now, and then we're going to do a seated hunt in a field right behind us over here. And then we're going to break for the day, and then we're going to come back together tonight and do a night hunt. So, looking forward to that. But, um, anyway, uh, Jacob is over there trying to find him a little piece of gold with that little metal detector. And uh, he's going through some dirt, too. He's using that flow pan. If you haven't seen that video on that flow pan, I'll throw it up here in the corner and let you see that. That thing works really, really good. So I showed him how it works and uh, said, hey, take off after it, dude. So, um, but we're going to convene here to get, we're going to meet up together here in just a few minutes and go see that field in a minute. So, all right, we'll bring you in when we uh, do this hunt. We are, we are planting fools, ain't we? we are. Seeding fools. That's how we do it, y'all. No secret to it. Just put them in the ground. This is your favorite part, Aunt Chris. Yeah. 
And we got five tokens, no, six tokens over here for people to look for to find. And there's silver over here, uh, an Indian head penny, a buffalo nickel, and a bunch of relics and crap. That's about the best way to explain it. Pull tabs and stuff like that. See that bagger? And that's, that's, this is for later. That's, that's for, what Southern Relics calls relics. Yeah, that's tomorrow. That's what we're going to add tomorrow. And you know what people win if they find that? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Second seated hunt has begun. There they go. Kelvin found something interesting over here that uh, we didn't actually plant in the ground. An old toy. Yep. That's an uh, that's a, a handle to an old toy gun. That's pretty neat. Yeah, we didn't put that over here, so there was an old home place here. We do well. We knew that ahead of time, but. So, good job, Kevin. Well, That's it. it Number nine. Okay. Can good I job. keep looking? You can keep looking. Okay. Good job. If you find another one, just put. Let's leave it. Put it back. Okay. One of the six okay. tokens were found. I can't. I don't know. One, but uh, a lot is. of people yeah, found some good I stuff. Uh, I got the we got the mercury yeah, dime here. Mm -hmm. uh, we did put that. I mean, we put pretty much all of this. I didn't put these two. Yeah, we did put that out there. See, I don't see if I see anything that we didn't put out there. Okay, good, good. I put those out there. There's a silver right there. That's not a silver, but that is. That ain't silver. Yep. And then silver right there. That in the bag. Yeah. And then yeah. Stuff like that, right? Yours? A lot of good stuff. A lot of goodies. Yeah, interesting for interesting relics out there. I think I'm missing one. Yeah, a bunch of relics and stuff. Yep. Oh, cool. Sure enough. Interesting finds. Interesting finds. That's just wrong. I don't think I put that out. That's a that's a that's a natural. Somebody yes, put really put it. I put that out there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay, you found that. Yeah. Sure enough, there's a horseshoe out there. I put that out there. Yeah. Yeah. yeah a horseshoe. He know he found two of these. Well, I know this penny. I didn't put that out there. That's cool. That's a chain. Airplane. You put that out there. I did. Hey, Payne. Oh, hey, Payne. So whenever I, I'll draw a number. He'll draw a number. And then that's who wins. Is he whatever, win, whatever the number is, that's who wins it. Last four, two, zero, six, one. That's me. Hey. Oh, yeah. There you go. I need you. Two bags. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what's number seven? All right, number seven is a knock to digger tool. Right there. All right. Oh. Number seven was. Well, he's, he's, oh, you're you're, you're, yours done got drawn, so, so you won't be able to get another one. You got this, you want one win, one one yeah. draw, one win. Two zero five six. Right. Here. Right. We got you a premium wow. digger tool. Yeah. All right, which one? Eight. We're on eight. A Kelly Co hat. There you go. I actually like the hat it. myself. <laughs> Two zero six two. Six two. Yep. Zero. Six, two. Six two. There you go. Right. Excellent. Yes, ma'am. Thank, Thank you. All right. Um, <laughs> which one? What are we doing? We got. We just did the half, right? Yep. So oh, the number right. ten. Right, yeah, 10. ten. Oh, that's the painter. This is this right here. Some gold and the pan. And the pan with a little dirt in the in the bag to go with it. Two zero six zero. Hey, there you go. <laughs> and uh, you know, you know the token that would that was num for number ten was that. That's the token that you would have found if you'd have went one more foot. Yep, note defines pouch. Last one. Last no, Last prize. Last prize going to drum roll, please. Two zero five seven. Imagine that. 
Okay, well, I just went and got my son, and uh, there he is. He made it. <laughs> yeah, I met uh, met my wife about halfway, or a little over halfway, so she didn't have to drive so far. And uh, we're walking down here to the office, the main office, and uh, they have us supper. Pizza it is. But uh, night hunt's coming up, and uh, we'll try to film what we can. I need to do some on my phone so y'all can see it. Uh, but yeah, it's... I love it down here. Love this camp. Yeah, I love all the LDMA. What am I talking about? I love all the LDMA, LDMA camps. Oconee, Loud, Vane, Stanton. Never been to the other ones, but Duesenberg, Burnt River. What's the other one's called? I can't remember. But hey, have a good time. If you're not an LDMA member, at least go check out one of the camps. And they'll put you on some gold, I promise. You know, pay that little small little fee to get it. But anyway go go get involved go uh and some of these events and some of the some of the outings they do you don't have to be an LDMA member to sign up so check in on that as well i'll put everything down in the description myldma.com check out the website and see what you can find out about them find the one closest to you go visit it but it's pizza time we're gonna go get a pizza we just started the night hunt and I'm talking about five seconds in, we got one, already found one. It's not gonna be hard, just gotta swing and find them. We got some over here moving about, trying to find them, find what they're looking for. I love these night hunts, these are so fun. This was courtesy of Garrett Metal Detectors. You all get one of these if you have got a if you found a token. Mm -hmm. These are fines boxes. Goes with my Garrett Medical. Does. Congratulations. Yeah. And tonight's hunt was sponsored by Garrett. So. Congratulations. Well, we just sitting here in our little chairs right here. Chris over here sitting around, and Jacob's over there sitting around. And uh, we just relaxing lunch time for another 11 minutes but uh turn the camera around here and let chris talk to you a minute hey fans <laughs> now we've actually we've had a really good weekend this weekend uh i hope everybody enjoyed it and had had fun and, and maybe learned a little something hope so i've spilled my knowledge into them it took about three minutes and i was done I was just, I, I did find out that I am Southern Relic's mule. I, uh, I'm good for hauling and planting stuff in the fields. Will we find out about what Jacob is? You know, I just want to say this. I really appreciate these guys. You know, coming out here and not having to dig no holes or anything, just watching them bury everything. I had a great time. <laughs> Appreciate it. Now we're going to do this last hunt. So we'll see you guys in the field. Or you can see us in the field. And we're going to see who wins the final stuff. Yeah. We're giving away that Simplex Ultra. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Number 13. 13. Two tokens found before we go. I'm going to let Jacob Coffey choose our winners. So this is going to be for the... I know. <laughs> Detector's going first. Simplex, Ultra. $359 value. Who's taking it home? $21.52. Yay! <laughs> Kelly Co. Hat. Twenty-one fifty. Yeah. And the Kelly or not? That's the Nook Pound. The Nook Pound. Yep. It's got a belt included and all that. Some of y'all already got these. Twenty-one fifty-five. 
I can't believe I'm actually having to finish this video at home with the relic wall. <laughs> no, I forgot to record and let Chris and Jake and all of us just say bye together. I forgot that. That's my bad. My bad. You know, you can't do it all. You can't run an event and do your video sometimes. And uh, I was passing that camera on to Chris, Jacob, my son Jacob there for a while, you know, just because there's so much involved with events. And I think it went really well. Really, really excited um, about next year. Um, the LDMA is going to be doing some different things when it comes to events next year. And uh, so we're going to make some changes on how we do those as well. Um, still plan on doing some. Uh, still plan on being back at Vane Mountain, back at Oconee. I'm still working on Loud Mine again. Uh, LDMA does want us to go to California, to Duesenberg Gold Camp out in California. And I got to make that happen. But it may not be in 2024. Um, me and my family's got a couple trips planned. And those days for vacation has already been locked up for that. Um, matter of fact, we're going to Alaska on a cruise. That's going to take two weeks of my vacation time. And then we have another trip planned for spring break. And that's going to take another week of my time. So... My time gets short right there. So next year um, is going to be the year of trips for my family. So uh, I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to still do the events, but it'll just be local stuff. I won't be able to go um, across the country next year. Uh, me and Chris and Jake were talking about doing a, uh, we were, we, you know, we were together the other day and we were talking about doing an actual event. Not us doing one, but going to one. So I'm going to leave it up to you guys. If Southern Relics went to an event, where would you want us to go and where y'all could see us or y'all can not just y'all but where would you want us to go now we've talked about going to the garrett hunt out in texas we talked about going to dig stock they got one in north carolina next year uh or even the one in new york or wherever they plan on doing it or y'all tell me uh, i know they do one in arkansas as well i tell you what you put in the comment section where you want southern relics to go next year and if i can make it happen on my vacation time and we all can make it happen, we'll go digging instead of putting on an event next year. And we're gonna let you guys do that for us and pick that pick that one for us. There's some short little clips here of stuff that didn't actually make it into the, I'm, I'm gonna say it made it in the video, but it made it more in the blooper section. So y'all watch that and I hope you have a good day. God bless and we will see you next time. <laughs> He goes, would you already eat your two? And he goes, no, I only had the one. And the team goes, oh. <laughs> Remember when he was eating oh, the yeah. two sandwiches? <laughs> you better turn around. <laughs> <laughs> if you're ready, we'll take her up. <laughs> okay, we'll see you later.